back with me. I have uh, Sue. She's an excellent massage therapist in, in our office. So massage, I mean, I, I haven't seen anyone say no to massage yet. <laughs> I mean, uh, do, you, do you come across that at any time? Uh, very few, but hardly, rarely at all. Yeah, so, yeah. I mean, uh -huh. we, all, we all enjoy uh, getting relaxed and being massaged, and I, I know you do excellent massage, but you also have the aspect of when people are dealing with health issues rather than just relaxation. I mean, we all want to relax, mm -hmm. and, and it's great just for that, but health issues, you know, what? where does massage come into play now? Oh, it helps a lot of people, especially with like sleep issues and stuff like that. A lot of times people will say, you know, I'm not able to sleep. A lot of times after their massages, they, they said, oh man, for the next three days or so, you know, I got the best sleep I've ever had. Yeah. Uh, lots of times maybe for people who have high blood pressure and are trying to keep that under control or stress levels and things like that. So it, it, it helps and obviously to reduce the stress in the body. Mm -hmm. You have, you know, stress, you deal with the adrenal they secrete the stress hormones and then when you massage and you relax the body mm -hmm. so you're not as stressed mm -hmm. uh, but other benefits I mean you, you have people we live, live in a very toxic environment so uh, so we deal with all these toxins and we need to get them out of the body how I mean how can massage be a benefit in that area well it helps really a lot especially with people who uh, like for limp drainage and things like that it'll help uh, move that through so their system can naturally uh, remove that from their body and stuff like that when we do a limp draining s system yeah and, and mm -hmm. I, I know what a lot of people don't recognize I mean they they take all these vitamins and minerals and they think that it's magically just going to land in the different cells you know, and different tissues where they need to go. Mm -hmm. And they don't recognize that before getting into these cells, you have all that, all these toxins that we've accumulated. Mm -hmm. And so the nutrients somehow have to kind of make through, you know, make it through all these toxins in order to be able to get to the cell. Mm -hmm. So with, you know, working on that lymph, you know, clearing out all that toxins and I would assume that would Im improve then the nutrition uptake. For the nutritional uptake, yeah, it does. It does. Well, it also helps your uh, blood flow and stuff like that so that your body can absorb all the better nutrients and things like that. Too. Yeah, and, I, so and, and I've heard it's a, from my understanding is that blood flow is a good thing. Mm hmm. Yeah. It is, yes. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> yeah. just, just, just rumors, that is. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so if, if we can then support and the transport of nutrients into all the different areas, mm -hmm. yeah, which which obviously is, will support us overall health-wise. Correct, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. So what, what kind of people tend to come to you the majority of the time? I mean, what, what kind of ailments do you see over oh. and above just stress reduction? Oh, we get stress reduction. People with uh, like arthritis and, um, you know, um, sometimes sports people who have done a lot of of overexertion to help them with their range of motion, helps their muscles to uh, get back into shape again, again helps their blood flow and their circulation and things like that. So um, just about all kinds and types of, of people. So Wonderful. So yeah, you, it's interesting you mentioned them. Uh, you have all these uh, weekend warriors, all, all these athletes that really push hard and uh, they put a lot of stress in on the ligaments, muscles, and, and so forth, and they need to recover quicker. Mm -hmm. And so how, how does massage help in that area? Uh, it helps, uh, it goes with their uh, range of motion and things like that. It will help their muscles recover quicker. Uh, again, it helps uh, push out some of the toxins and stuff like that. Um, and then um, just helps the blood flow so that it comes back into the muscles quicker. So yeah. it just makes them recover quicker. So, because all those toxins, if they're not pushed out, I mean, because when we're exercising, we're increasing metabolism and all these toxins, uh, metabolic waste, or mm -hmm. say, is produced mm -hmm. from that. And if we don't remove that, that creates a lot of inflammation, correct? In, right, in that area. Yeah, yeah. And they also get very sore lots of times. It helps that soreness to go away quicker. E exactly. Mm -hmm. So, so you reduce the soreness, but also then. Uh, by moving those toxins out, then you also reduce your chance and for re-injuring that area. True, yes. And you uh -huh. can recover the area much quicker. Much quicker, yes, indeed. Um, then you mentioned things like arthritis, and I assume like rheumatoid arthritis, any kind of joint mobility mm -hmm. uh, is issue mm -hmm. would mm -hmm. be beneficial. Yeah, you can get in there and like you said, kind of keep things moving and keep things limber and sometimes yeah. help them with um, you know, different exercises and things like that to be able to do too to help them uh, have a better life. Yeah, 
So um, and then we have things like fibromyalgia, for instance, is a very common syndrome I, I see a lot of people are suffering from. Mm -hmm. um, and where you have all these different trigger points. Does, does that help also with massage in, or? It does, it does. It helps them uh, relieve some of their pain and stuff because a lot of the fibromyalgia people have do have a lot of uh, pain associated with that. And so it helps the discomfort on level go down. Yeah, mm -hmm. so I mean, so it's, and, and how frequently should a person come in if you're dealing with a health issue? I mean, what, what is a common um, it, it really kind of depends. Uh, you know, everybody's different. So yeah. um, I most often people like to come in at least like once a month. I like to see people. Yeah. Uh, massage is one of those wonderful things that builds on itself. So, you know, coming in once is great and wonderful. Yeah. Coming in lots more often does a lot better. It always just, you know, it's kind of like... Um, just just helps you along a lot more. Yeah. yeah, so it's just kind of retraining the body mm -hmm. then to kind of step by step getting more into healthy healthy state. Yeah, exactly. So, uh -huh. Wonderful. Well, thank you very much. No, you're, you're truly, welcome. I know you're awesome. <laughs> so yeah. Uh,